Hey guys, welcome back. This is episode 32, I think, and I found another stronghold. So that's fantastic. Um, I didn't really spend that much time looking for it. Um, my house is actually like... <sighs> the way I got here, normally I went along the edge of the lava lake, then went up a bit and around, and then back out farther that way. But instead of looping back around that time, I just came this way, and found one over here. It just happens to be near, like, the scariest looking place I've ever seen in the nether. Because there's just lava pouring from the ceiling here, all over the place. And it's quite terrifying. But, um, I did manage to find one. So, hold on a second. Um, I, I actually just asked a friend if he could play League of Legends with me. And, um, I'm sure he'll post something in the comments, so, you know. Anyway, um, so I was just texting him to say, hold on a second, because I'm recording. I wasn't expecting him to, uh, answer me. So, I need to find a way <laughs> to get down here without dying and or severely injuring myself. And, oh, jeez. Okay, that was weird. I got stuck, um, walking around a bit. I don't know. It was weird. Anyway, um... Yeah, I can't, I can't use this, like, water to get down, so I'm just going to seal it off, because, Jesus, this stuff goes for miles. No! No, that's not the solution to the problem here. No, get back! <sighs> Jeez. I, I do like how the, the lava goes farther in the nether. It seems very, I don't know, it, it just seems right to me. You know, I mean, it's like water on the surface, just not. Okay, um, I did see a blaze down there somewhere, which worried me a little bit. But he doesn't seem to be there anymore, so that's good at least. Is this going to go all the way down? Nope. It goes almost all the way down. Can I? Mm, no, I can't, but I can just drop down and do that. And, oh dear god, this looks so dangerous right now. Um, give myself a little barrier. Oh, jeez. Almost fell into the lava there. Okay. And then another barrier on this side. Okie dokie. And then the ones that have very few blocks underneath, I will just do that. Okay, so now that should be pretty safe. I mean, not the safest thing, but safer than others. And, oh good, they did make it so that these things mine faster. Because I would like to gather some nether brick, and I don't think you can make it yet. Um, if you can, then... Psh, I'm stumped. Oh, spawner! No. Okay, I feel like my flame aspect isn't going to help me very much here. But I really do wish that I had some magma cream with me. Okay, that's pointless. That's not going to help me. Um, these things spawn at, like, incredibly high light levels. So you have to get them down so, so low before it does anything. And nope. 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 <sighs> I'm glad they nerfed the fire on those guys, though. Because that could have been extremely, extremely painful. Okay. That's supposed to stop pouring any time now. See, they made it so that it pours farther, but they never fixed it so that... Or they never made it so that it pours faster. Which really bothers me. Because, um... I'm going to get some netherrack so I can... Because I want to make a trap there for the blazes. But... <clears throat> um... I don't have enough stone or netherrack to cover up... Gas... Uh... To cover up the spawner. Because the way I make the spawner, it's going to, um... <coughs> because the blazes can fly, so they're really hard to deal with. Um, they only really fly if they see you first. But, nonetheless, they can fly. So, um... Like, I can't make a drop trap with them, for them, like I did in the last one. And even if I wanted to, or like I did with the other two spawners. Um, and even if I wanted to, I probably couldn't since, you know, we're in the nether. And there's just a big drop of lava underneath it, so... Um, okay, seriously, where is that ghast? And, edge! A 
Okay, I need to be careful. Um, I don't know if a stack is going to be enough. I hope so. Um, let's see. Where did I go down? How did I get down there? <laughs> no! Already? Oh, there it is. Okay. I mean, I know I lose stuff, but that would that would have been ridiculous. Okay. That should that should give me a good idea of where it is. I hope. Mostly just because the the tower is high contrast with everything else. I'll just put that there. That should be there. Okay. Um because the cobblestone just like looks so bright in the nether compared to everything else. So yeah, see, there's a blaze over there. I don't know if you saw him or not. But he's freaking me out. Okay, I believe the blazes also have the same um, spawning area as the other spawners, which would, bruh, which would be an 8x8 eight eight area fire. Ow, my legs. Um, or did I say eight by eight? I meant eight by eight by three. Um, nope, 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 no fire for you. Um, so that means that. Okay, well, for no. Stop flying. There we go. Okay, there we go. All right. Um, so, yeah, uh, there should be an 8 by 8 by 3 area around there where they, sh where they would be able to spawn, and I'm trying to cover that up now, but I don't have enough, <laughs> I don't have enough, no, okay, I'm gonna F3 and cheat real quick, okay, so, no, that, blaze run, okay, I think that was the first one I got. Okay, so we're in the negative, so when I go this way, that one's going down, that one's going up. Okay, so it's this way. 94 goes to 95, 258 goes to 259. Okay, so that means this side is the side, like this is the center of the square, so it goes out four in that direction and four in that direction, and then oh, same for these directions. So that means out here, it gets, I don't know why I put the blocks up there. For some reason, I mistook that as the the area where they can spawn. I know there's one over here. He's right there. Get out of here. Which means that... Oh, God. Um, yes, we have one, two, three, four... Wow, so they can spawn all the way out to this block over here, which means I need a lot more netherrack, so um, I'm going to grab some, and I'll be right back. Okay, guys, sorry about that. I ended up uh, building the entire thing because I don't have that much time left on my video, and I didn't want to end up not finishing it in time. So, basically, um, this is the one place that they can spawn. There's just this one two-block high area here. Um, normally they'd be able to spawn in these blocks, but I covered it up so they can't, and they can't spawn down here because, um, the, it does adhere to the same spawning principles, so, um, they can only spawn as low as the block underneath the spawner, which means their feet would be in this area, and their heads would be here, which can't happen because there's a block there. So, yeah, it's not the fanciest trap. Like, if you watch Etho, he recently made a blaze trap that's much fancier than mine, and it, uh, um... They, they all spawn and then fall and get pushed with pistons down into a smaller pit in the middle, and again and again, and um, they land in a little area where he just crushes them to death. So um, that way he doesn't have to deal with... It crushes them almost to death so that they have a little bit of health left and he can just punch them, um, which works pretty well. But I am not going to do that, not right now at least, especially because there's a giant pit under there, which I should really set up a a little wall over here. Um, and yeah, I tried to take care of the lava situation here. Uh, didn't do too well with it, but it fixed the problem for now. So that will eventually stop because I plugged it up up there. But yeah. 
So that's my blaze spawner trap thing. Um, it always spawns at least one. Um, I every once in a while you get two. This isn't nearly very. Um, this isn't nearly as efficient as any other trap that I've ever seen, but it does get the job done. So I've got a few blaze rods, which do work instead of coal apparently. So you can make um, you can cook stuff with it, which works great. Okay, there's a blaze around here. Apparently I left a hole. But anyway, I have to go. So um, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.